Tonight at 5, our veterans are being recognized all around the country, including here in Minnesota. The Mall of America hosting a special ceremony that included the Minnesota National Guard's 34th Infantry Division Red Bull Band. Fox 9's Bab Santos is live with more on the special day. Babs? Yeah, Karen, that event ended just earlier this afternoon. It was just one of many happening all around the metro. Dozens gathered at the Mall of America on Saturday to honor all who've worn a uniform and served in the United States Armed Forces. The Mall's Rotunda was the place to be for speeches and performances this Veterans Day, celebrating generations of sacrifice to protect our homeland. Freedom is not free. It takes a great sacrifice. The crowd thanked those who've given their lives to the country in death or in a life spent overseas. And many of the people on the receiving end of that gratitude were there to receive it in person, including vet Terrence Bernard. The national anthem always gets me. Saluting all the people that have gone before you. Ernest Denzer is always grateful for the acknowledgement this holiday brings each year, but he says the praise shouldn't just go to vets like himself, but also to their families that stand by and support the mission. Wives that still have to stay home and figure out how to make the mortgage payments and raise the teenage kids. Just north of the mall at Fort Snelling Cemetery, it was a busy day as so many families stopped by to pay their respects to vets. Standing by at the entrance, this man was surrounded by hats left behind to represent the different branches on this holiday. Many people making the reminder to honor veterans, not just on Veterans Day, but on every day. And you might have caught it there at the end of the story, a familiar face, our own Fox 9 anchor Tim Blotz actually hosted the event here today at the Mall of America. Live in Bloomington tonight, Bab Santos, Fox 9.